Now that you've set up a Proxmox server, it's time to host some services and applications by installing Ubuntu server as a virtual machine. Start by visiting ubuntu.com forward slash download forward slash server and downloading the latest LTS version of Ubuntu server. Save the ISO file somewhere accessible. Next, log in to the Proxmox server using the web interface, navigate to your Proxmox node's local storage, and open the ISO images section. Then from there, you're going to click upload and then select the Ubuntu server ISO and wait for it to upload. Once the process is complete, you'll see a task OK message. To create the VM, right click on your server node and select create VM. In the general section, give the VM a name like Ubuntu-Server-Test. Under the OS section, select the uploaded ISO file as the virtual CD slash DVD drive, leaving the default settings for the guest OS and system configuration. For storage, select a location and allocate disk space, though the default options will work for most users. Assign CPU cores in the CPU section, defaults are fine, and set the memory to 4 gigabytes, also known as 4096 megabytes. Leave the network settings as default and ensure you checked the box to start the VM after creation. Click finish and the VM will be created and start automatically. Once the VM is up and running, access the console tab in Proxmox to begin setting up the Ubuntu server. Select try or install Ubuntu server and follow the prompts starting with your preferred language. Skip updates to speed up installation and leave the keyboard configuration, network settings, and proxy configurations as default. Use the entire virtual disk for storage, confirm the formatting, and proceed to the profile setup. Here, name the server Ubuntu-Server-Test, set a username, and create a password. During installation, select Install Open SSH Server to enable remote access, though you can also use the Proxmox console for administration. Skip importing an identity or installing additional services unless needed. After the system installation completes, reboot the VM and press Enter to remove the installation media. Log in using the credentials you created and update the system by running the command sudo apt Dash get update, followed by sudo apt dash get upgrade. Confirm any prompts by typing Y. At this stage, you may notice the Proxmox summary doesn't display the virtual machine's IP address. To fix this, you're going to want to enable QEMU guest agent. In the Proxmox web interface, go to the VM's options section and enable QEMU agent. Return to the Ubuntu console, install the guest agent by running the command sudo apt-get, install qemu-guest-agent, and reboot the machine. You can reboot easily by shutting down the virtual machine in Proxmox, then restarting it. With everything set up, your Ubuntu virtual machine on Proxmox is ready for use. You can now begin hosting services and applications, fully utilizing your server's potential. Don't forget to like and subscribe to see more content like this.